Perez and Mike Motts in yes. the studio with me. And you guys are doing a reality show, basically living off of your talent. Yes, <laughs> yes. It's kind of a documentary, like we're, we're pitching for a reality show. Um, we're in a minivan. We don't even have the luxury of an oh, RV. Wow. Yeah. And um, we're just, we're doing all 50 states in one year. It's, it's really a test of faith in yourself. Absolutely. In 50 states, two comics, one year. So you're going to perform in every single state in the country. Yes. And you just told me Florida is state 16. State 16. Mm -hmm. Like acclimating to whatever state we're in. And uh, within two weeks of being in Florida, I have a cane and a hearing aid, so. <laughs> hey, Speak D with the all new Y100. I got a few special guests in the studio hanging out with me today. Uh, Barbara Perez and Mike Motts. How's it going on, guys? I'm a native of Colorado. I was a single mom. I know how to make money stretch. I know how to make stuff out of nothing. Are you? If you're in Safeway on 26th of Federal and they're selling arugula, don't you think to yourself, oh, then white people are coming. <laughs> I have never seen a smothered burrito topped with arugula! <laughs> I had to look up arugula! <laughs> Denver Public Schools. I misspelled it, so I still couldn't figure out what it was. <laughs> it's not just a comedy, it's the message behind it. And there's so many people out there that have, have big dreams and huge talent that it's their own mind that's holding them back. Their mind is telling them, you can't do this. Your mind is your worst enemy. And if you just realize this is my dream, this is what I want to do, nothing's going to stop me, you don't have to know. You don't have to plan for how it's going to work. As long as you're dedicated to following the faith in whatever it is that you hold your faith in, you can have a faith in God, you can have a faith in yourself, you can have a faith in your dream. The point is have faith yep. wherever it is. I agree. And you just, you hold on to it. It's hard going without creature comforts, you know, but it, being from Colorado, I grew up, um, you know, camping out on the road. It's, it's very second nature to me with him being from New Jersey you know he's I don't think he re really even like camped in his backyard in a no. tent so this <laughs> is no I, I'm like a very city guy if the zombie apocalypse came I'd be like the first one dead I would be <laughs> done yeah you guys had really bad floods you handled it you dealt with it I'm watching TV and you got this local reporter standing. She's like on Spear Avenue down there. She's like, oh, Spear Avenue is covered in three feet of water. And it's going to be very, very difficult. I'm watching this. I see a guy in a lowrider behind her. <laughs> and he pulls up when he looks at her and he goes, oh, no problem. Hits some switches. <laughs> well, there you go. All cars should have that. And like living off the land, I would never make it unless like the land had a mall on it or something. <laughs> Since starting this, we've blown our transmission. just been outside flipping out. And we lost all the electric system in the van. But were we in the rain? No, thank God I had the trash bag because it won't roll, <laughs> the window won't roll up because we have no power. But at least it's not that the window is broken. Ouch. No, that's true. I've broken my leg. This is just gonna blow everything out of the water. Not necessarily. Quit being, quit being so negative. You don't think people have overcome worse than broken ankles? You're really gonna give up on this? Ow! 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 ow. Watch the bones. It's radiating and it's just it's. <laughs> Ooh. But you guys, I mean, the comedy seems to present itself with you, and I can't oh, yeah. wait to see what happens on the rest of your journey 50 states two comics one year and y'all are just getting it done you're throwing yeah. it out there in the universe and making it happen yeah, love it right. because i believe that that you know everybody comes together can can make a dream happen mm -hmm. and in supporting our dreams somehow just the way things work there will be a point in time where it's it's symbiotic and somehow i'll come around and what i'm doing is going to support what you want to do it's just the way it works that way mm -hmm. i like that